to today's ride in particular because I'm going to be doing the uh, the Black Mountain Pass in the Cumbrian Mountains which is uh, the road that the Top Gear team did so this morning going from Landidno Wells all the way to Cardigan Bay down to Haverford West up to Carmarthen down to Ramerford and it's this road here that he talks about the A4069 going up to Landwoods and then up from Landovery to Brecon. Can't wait to get cracking so jump on the back and enjoy some of the Welsh countryside and scenery. Left at nine so it only took two hours to get here. Um, so somewhere is the bay of Cardigan so I think the sea is over to the left there so I just met uh, an Italian gentleman so my name is Darren what's your name Roberto Roberto nice your to meet you your name is Darren Darren and you've traveled all the way from Italy yeah and you're enjoying yeah, the fine maybe, British weather uh, we are from <laughs> Verona you know Verona Verona the town of yeah. Romeo and Juliet oh Romeo and Juliet yeah well I, of course I know that yeah don't yeah. look at that Oh, what's that? Remember to drive on the left. Really? Okay. So when you pull off, that's the time when you leave, when you forget. Yes. When you pull some, off. Sometimes I forget. Yeah, yeah. We've all done it. I think yeah. we've all done it. Especially, especially in the early morning. Yeah. When uh, the first, the first time I go on the street. Uh, yeah. Uh, the mind is not. Uh, yeah, awake. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> It's useful to remind to stay on the left. Yeah, good idea. Yeah, I like it. <laughs> no, right, so. okay. So, well, I'll get a bite to eat and then uh, carry on with the trip. But it's nice to meet you, Roberto. Yeah. So I've just found the uh, cafe called Food for Thought in uh, in the High Street in uh, in Cardigan, and I just met a gentleman and a couple. Well, a couple actually on their bike. I don't know what bike it is, but it's over there. And they've just travelled from Italy and they're touring all around the UK. Bit of brunch here, then head on up uh, to the north of Cardigan Bay and just have a look at the sea and then uh, and then do the afternoon route towards Brecon, which is supposed to be one of the best uh, roads. Just get a nice uh, replenishment stop there. Just sort of drive down to the uh, coastline and catch a little bit of the coast in Cardigan. And this is the uh, bay. So just topping up to do the uh, ride from Cardigan to Brecon. I think this is the fourth refuel now. This is uh, top of the tank up, that's 25 quid. Go to the Black Forest Mountain Pass. top of the Black Forest Mountain Pass with yeah. Mr. Ice Cream Man. So what's your name? Kevin. Kevin. Yeah. yeah. What, what a lucky job, good yeah. job you've got. Oh yeah. Serving good... all the bikers. <laughs> Am I about halfway across then? Is yeah. This the this is the top. This is the top though. Is yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Yeah. Cheers. Thanks Thank for you. that, Kevin. Is that a camera?
bit of a hairpin here you could be up in the uh, Swiss Alps got some free time then get yourself over here and ride the Black Mountain Pass Road the 4069 beautiful it's lovely nice and cool in these uh, shady sections temperatures 21 degrees at the moment it's uh, 10 to 6 in the evening and I do like the BMW sat nav uh, just here, it gives you an indication as to which way the road So I always look at this before I get to the bend, so I can put the bike on the right trajectory going into the bend. find that really useful. Yeah, so this road's really nice, I've not ridden it before, but the book I'm taking the loop from says this is the second part that's really nice. So I am now experiencing that. It's nice and cool in the evening now. It's British summer time, so it's nice summer evening. Nice shady section in this uh, foresty bit. I've got about 17 miles left on this route. And I've been on the bike all day. I obviously stopped in Cardigan Bay. Um, another coffee stop just before we came over the Black Mountain. And I've thoroughly enjoyed myself. Yeah, so 442 pounds guys and that's subjective as to what accommodation you want to stop in you can camp the duration or you can go airbnb or you can go in a bnb or you can go in a hotel whatever suits your, suits your needs and, uh, and potentially finances i did a bit of both just to sort of mix it up a bit um, and it's subjective as to how much you can uh, afford uh, but thoroughly enjoyed this Wales trip, fantastic roads out that way. The two things I'd put on your bucket list is the Lamberis Pass 
and the Black Forest uh, Mountain Pass. Uh, uh, that was just a fantastic uh, ride to do. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video and if you did then press the like button. Uh, thank you for subscribing. If you're not already subscribed then uh, press the subscribe button down below to support the channel and I did put a bit of, bit of effort into these uh, four episodes. Uh, I even had to shave to do this recording. Um, so take care for now and safe riding. Bye for now.